Okay, in tonight's 11th race, a pretty good drive there by Brad Hanner, stole the second quarter on Metropolis and was able to fend off the furious late charge of Bahama Bunning. Um, our long shot pick in the race, pretty good to finish third. That was Cinder Lane Sam. And uh, firm belief who we thought we might need one tonight. Hard for these horses to come in off of just one qualifier and go right into the uh, best uh, group on the grounds. Uh, more times than not is a bet against. Uh, actually, three pretty good handicapping tips tonight. Don't bet three-year-olds early in the year against older horses. Don't bet uh, top-notch horses their first start of the year when they have to go in tough. And don't bet fillies against boys on the pace. That is uh, leading to economic suicide at the races. Twelfth uh, race tonight, uh, trainer on the seven is J.L. Adams. That's who we like, Yankee Fletcher. Went virtually wire to wire last week for one of the top drivers at the Meadows, Doug Snyder. David Miller has the drive tonight. Not much gate speed in here. And uh, Yankee Fletcher could be rolling right along on the front end. Two, Dozier Hanover. We didn't like this guy last week. He was uh, four to five, didn't perform all that well. Uh, a couple of weeks ago, he was scratched off the track at the Meadows. Had uh, about three weeks up, and he might be a little bit better in here tonight. Does like to win, as evidenced by his seven out of 14 so far this year. Let's go to the outside. Armbro Nate dropping down in class tonight. Was in nine winners of 4,000 last five in his last effort. Uh, couldn't get untracked over the slightly off track last week, but uh, won 14 last year. Maybe he'll be on the rebound getting back with his own kind. Like the seven a lot in here right now. He's a pretty juicy two to one. Dozier Hanover may or may not be ready. He wasn't all that good last week. And uh, Arm Row Nate could be the uh, surprise package. We'll see here for the 13th and final, the Superfecta. Good luck, everybody.